like you're no watching this again, are you? Embarrassing, isn't it? I just can't believe she's gone. She was so young. She had so much to give. Sturgeon's no deed. She's just resigned. <gasps> oh, I. Oh, sorry. I just get caught up. I'm, I'm still sad about it. Pathetic. Crying your wee eyes out over that wee stupid bitch. Didn't I catch you crying and wanking into one of your Union Jack socks when the Queen died? That was different. That was... British! You really should get that blind spot checked, mate. She just did so much for Scotland. Like what specifically? Well, I mean, there was the, the baby, baby box. box. Baby box. Well, she was also a great communicator during the pandemic. During the pandemic, she did the exact same as the UK government just a week later. Did we all forget that? But she spoke better than Boris. A traumatised parrot with a speech impediment speaks better than Boris Johnson. I'm just glad that hate-filled vile Nazi's gone. Sometimes I think you live on a different planet. How was she a Nazi? Because she was a nationalist. Oh, nationalists are Nazis. You never did finish high school, did you? No, but I don't see what that has to do with anything. She brought Scotland closer to independence than ever before. Nine years! And she hasn't increased support by as much as a ball here. Not true. Any day now, her super secret plan will be revealed. She was playing seventh dimension chess this whole time. There's enough cognitive dissonance in this country to form a national fucking orchestra. She was the worst thing to happen to Scotland. I've got my issues with her, mate, but the worst thing? How? Because... Cause, Cause she was a nationalist! Nicola Sturgeon wasn't even a nationalist! What? She's an egotistical careerist, but she dangled independence in front of the voters to keep herself in power! She never had any intention of delivering it! Well, I'm, I'm, I'm glad she's gone! Why? She's the best thing you lot could have hoped for, but you're too fucking thick to see it! But, 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 we Jimmy Cranky! We Jimmy Cranky! We Jimmy Cranky! Once in a generation, we know. Christ, get some new pat armor. It's tough with a limited vocabulary. I just hope that whoever replaces her does a better job than she does, and we actually start talking policies instead of personality. Looks like Peter Murrow's going to rig it so that Hamza Yusuf's the next first minister. Well, that was a nice thought while it fucking lasted. I'm in the light at the end of the tunnel. Paper stacks, yeah, I got them in the bundles. Harry Potter breaking bread with the muggles. 